everybody, Gamer Penny here, bringing you another episode of our Spirit Fairer Let's Play, and we are back. Oh, we're moving, right? Yes, we are heading towards where we can potentially pick up a new crewmate. We've got our our field built here. We've got our guest house and our kitchen. We've been doing tons of cooking. That fish has a, w a way to go. It is becoming night, however. Uh, so maybe we'll do some late night cooking or late night fishing until we get there. I don't think we are moving. There's not a bar on the top. Hey, you dang thing! You didn't, you didn't go. You want to go here? Oops. Okay. Now we're moving. And from the looks of things, we are going to run into some jellies. Hey, you seagulls. Okay. Now we'll go fishing. Bum, 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 bum. It's probably going to be too late for us to get there right now. Herring. Can we sleep? Not yet. Get our cooked fish. Perfect. Do some more uh, fishing off the back. I think we have to be in that blue. The, I feel like it should be the darker one that's the night one, but I guess when it says ZZZ, that's the one where you sleep. <laughs> okay, another boot we can sell. Herring. I hope one of these people like fish, because I just made a... You know, we've caught a ton and I've uh, cooked a ton of fish. Well, someone's got to like them. Herring. In fact, let's put some more in there. How many... Can I see how many I have? How do you... Uh-oh. It's raining! Well, well, she says. We'll cook three. You got something to say? How are you? You're hungry. That's okay. I can- I gave you some coffee last time, so how about a popcorn? Mm. Oh, thank you, Stella. I love comfort food so damn much. Mm. Not a fan of this weather. Yeah, me neither. You want a hug? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm okay now. How are you? You're good. Okay. Bye. And we can't go any further, so we might as well, um, sleep. Yes, sleep till morning. Then we'll get where we need to go. I wonder if we're supposed to like fish in the rain. <laughs> Dinner's done. <laughs> Maybe we'll try to fish in the rain. Okay, we picked back up. Maybe we'll catch some special fish fish in the rain. Nope, just a herring. Okay. 
Oh. Look. That was all of our corn, so hopefully. Good morning. Oh. Barkensheim Creek discovered. What's another resource place? How are you? You're good. Okay, let me um go get this little barnacle thing. Empty shell. Get me up there. Okay. And come in here. These things. Good, because I just used the last of our corn. Okay, here let's put a coffee. Linen. Um, and another coffee, because I only have one corn thing left. So let's go to shore. Might have to go buy some more seeds at some point, but I think we're okay now. Okay. What's all this? Picnic basket? Get this. <laughs> I love it. Oh, and then we got a saw. Actually, saw on our keyboard. Okay. That one doesn't have any berries on it. That bush doesn't. Love how we're doing all the work, the cat's just hanging on to it. <laughs> Another one, wow. Hey. Oh, hey. Oh. Wait. Oh. Great. You're here. Listen. I just dropped a lemon in that pond. My fingers were all sticky. It just sort of slipped. Why? Good question. I've been eating delicious berries all day. Look at my hands, I swear. I've been experimenting. I wanted to squeeze a little bit of citrus on these wild fruit. Now it's just berries with no twist. Unless... It's just down there, in the water. I do it myself, but I have these pulpy fruits to take care of. Okay, I can do that. Oh my god, the cat's on the ball. I know, I didn't realize that before. We got a lemon. That's the one. I just need to find a tissue or something. I don't want to get berry juice all over it. Never mind. Just hold on to that lemon for me. Don't go and squeeze it. Wait a minute. Maybe you could help me? This island is fresh out of food. My stomach always feels empty. Maybe I could even help you aboard your ship. With cooking, fishing, and building. I don't have my spices and tools, but I'll make it work. Don't think about it so much. Let's just go to your boat. Oh, we got some guy here. Is that all that's on this island? No ro no rocks to do. I need quartz from somewhere. Hey. I'll be your favorite new passenger. Just you wait. Alright. Let's go. My, uh... Oh, I can't go in here. Okay. Stella! Oh, wow! This boat is amazing! Here comes the real kicker, you little rascal. Get ready for a family reunion. Uh-oh, he's a guy. He's a toad? I'm flashbanged. <laughs> he is! He's a frog. It's me, Stella. Your uncle, Atul. Surprised? Happily, I hope. I've been on that island for a while now. I can't wait to see the sights, the sea with you. It was lonely with my thoughts. Now I got you, Sprout. Let's set sail for a great adventure. Onwards. Wait a second. Is that a... Uh... Well, well. What are you excited for? I knew it! That's a Seamaster 2000! I've actually never seen it in action. I've only heard the rumors. Apparently, you can catch the biggest and brightest fish out there. 
Wow, Stella. You sure know how to treat yourself. Wait a darn second. You're missing a few bolts. Let me guess. You've been fishing out mostly garbage. Well, not anymore. Oh, yes. You'll see the difference immediately. Give it a go for a fan. Okay. Find a passenger in Hummingbird. Oh. Fish for your uncle a tool. Oh, I thought that thing was the... Oh! Oh no, there's fishing mechanics, okay. Not as easy as it was. Okay, let it up. Okay. Let it up. Oh, okay. Let it up. We got a squid! They never stood a chance. You sure don't mess around. That's what makes you a pro. All this ace level fishing has gotten me all rattled up. Which reminds me, I had this shiny thing in my pockets on the island. <coughs> Excuse me, I have no idea what it does. Maybe you can hold on to it. For safekeeping, I suppose. Oh, brother. I need to take a breather. Oh, and by the way, you might be curious and might have already tried, but yes, the water is very salty. Well, I'll take... I'll take... Go and take a look around. You can fish to your heart's content if you want. An oval. Ooh. Okay, I need to go in here and water these. I know, the dinner's done too. A minute, Gwen. I'll be right there. Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm -hmm. You've got two obols. Remember that shrine in Hummingbird? I'd add and I'd try and add them there. If we're lucky, it might do something amazing. If not, you'll have wasted your time. You should go see. Okay. How are you? I've got that weird feeling. I'm actually rather hungry. That's what I figured. Mm -hmm. Oh! Mm, no, sorry. So I didn't, didn't mean to give you that fruit. I wanted to give you... Coffee. Mm -hmm. Now this is one damn fine cup of coffee. I've ever done coffee. Mm -hmm. This is one of the best things I've ever done. Hug? Oh. Mm -hmm. Feeling much better. She's on top of the world. Okay. And how are you, sir? He's just okay. We don't know anything about him. Um, would you like a fish? Ooh. Oh boy, I just love food. Keep him coming. Ooh. I can't get enough of it. Would you like a hug? Oh. <laughs> Wasn't that great, favorite niece of mine? Okay, you're getting happier. All right, then let us go. Ooh, there's more stuff around here. Okay, let us go um, get these crates first. Whoops. Go cook. Can I cook the squid? And then we'll do some more fishing on the way. All right, we have two passengers now, huh? Uh-oh, it's raining. Uh-oh. We got a quest back there. He wants something. Another squid. Are you okay? This is what I call a storm. Any respectable person would never let their friend get hit by lightning. But I think you should try. You have the Everlight. It will protect you. 
lightning bolts will cast sparkles where they're about to hit. Rush toward those. Ah, I almost forgot. Have you got any empty bottles? Oh. If you're hit by lightning with an empty bottle, you get a lightning in a bottle. We need that. Isn't that bananas? This world. Oh. Lightnings and bottles are a pretty handy resource, so come here equipped. As a head start, there are a few bottles for you. But don't worry, they're pretty easy to come by. Get ready for the thrill of your life. Alright, it's about to sparkle where it gets hit. Oh, okay. Okay. We're in tons of lightnings in a bottle. What happens when I run out of bottles? <laughs> Dinner's ready. Oh, no more bottles. Okay. I'm all out. Oh. Oh, we get we get glimpse for that too, okay. So we wanna keep doing it, we just won't get We just won't get lightning in a bottle, we'll just get the uh, money for it. Which is fine. Whoops. Okay. All good? That was fun. Oh, thank goodness. I wasn't sure if you were going to make it there for a second. You gave your old uncle, qu uncle quite a scare. Did you feel that rumble? What a rush! You looked pretty awesome catching those jolts of lightning all over the boat. Thanks for being the best captain I could ever, could ever have hoped for. You're welcome. Let's go pick up our dinner. Squid skewer. Uh, let's make some coffee. I'll be done real quick. What else do you think he likes? Maybe the muscles? It's almost nighttime. Do some fishing. Bum, 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 bum. We got a crate. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's where I went, so. I was like, wait, did we randomly come across it? Perfect sea trash! Ooh. Quick, jump in the water! There's wreckage. I'm sure you'll find something helpful. Materials in there. Okay. Is that a quartz? It is. Gold? Copper ore, it just looks different at night. Empty bottle, maple, and some seeds. Okay. Cool. Let's go get our. Steamed self shellfish. Okay. All right, we made it. So let's set trail four. We need to go to Hummingburg. He said, uh, which is of course right here. Yes. Resources found sheep, shrine, rare chest, and spirit. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're about to go to bed soon. Oh, these need watering.
Too dark to navigate. Okay, we gotta go to bed. Yes. Alrighty. We're doing pretty good. I really want to get some more buildings built up, though. Be on our way. Good morning. How are you? You're hungry. So, let's give you... Please, I can't eat the same thing twice. I don't hate myself that much. I forgot. Popcorn. Thank you, Stella. I love comfort food so damn much. Talk. Glad you came to talk to me. Like I said earlier, we needed more people on this boat. New passengers. There's gotta be few people around. Lost like I was. One may not exactly like me. I'm aware of a few things that might not go... Uh, or that might go unnoticed by most. That's probably why father was always... Yeah, we heard that before. Uh, you want a hug? Sorry, I'm okay now. She's good. Um... Hey, uncle. Good morning. What do you like... Squid skewer. Oh boy, I just love food. Keep them coming. I can't get enough of it. Jeez, you gotta love the sights here. The sea, the sun, the breeze on my skin. Just feels so right. I'm happy to be aboard this ship. With you, my niece. I wish your Aunt Viv could see you right now, running your own ship, helping out these stranded souls. It really warms the heart. I'm glad you picked me up on that island. I'll try and make myself the least cumbersome passenger on this boat. Except for food. I'll never stop asking for delicious meals. Where did you go? You just jumped straight up there, huh? You sniffing at the kitchen? <laughs> Can we hug? I've got something on my mind. Give me a minute. Okay. Well, we're here. Oh. Crops need water. Okay. Okay. Then let's put the uh, coffee. You're good. Uh, corn. And then water you. And this one should be done soon, though, huh? Oh, we just watered it again. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's go to shore. Maybe we can buy it. Do I have enough to buy that key? I don't think so. Hello. Oh. Good day to you. We talked to these people before. Acquire. Du oh, new ability. Double jump. Hell yeah. I just say I wish we had double jump. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. All right, so we could go further along. Hello, everybody. Oh, hey. I'm browsing for some fiber. Can I buy, um, limestone? I don't want limestone. I want, uh, quartz. Field, uh, I'm gonna buy three of those. <laughs> so happy. Wait. Okay, here. Ah. Good job! You made it! Wicked moves getting up here. I kind of lied earlier. It's not so great up here. We are here, so it might get better. I don't have a membership card for you. You'll be an honorary member of the upstairs crew. I show you the secret handshake, but I don't know where your hands have been. <laughs> so I can go inside here. 
Is that a sheep? Cute. My sister keeps asking me for money. How can I say, say no without saying no? Maybe I should ask someone to rob me. <laughs> what? Hmm. I just don't want to loan my sister money. Yes, young person? Can I assume you are busy? Of course you're busy. Wait a second. You don't have a full service kitchen. Come back when you do. I have quite the pitch for you. Oh. Full service. Wait, what's that? Oh. Linen seeds. Okay. Well, those are like big treasures. These things. Okay. Um. What's down here? Ah. Huh. Hello. What? Oh! You gave me such a fright! That cat. He looks familiar. Daffodil? Is that you? Oh yes, yes it is! Ever so silky, aren't you? Then that must mean... Stella, is that really you? What a fantastic turn of events. Is that your boat over there at sea? You've came to rescue me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time I'll be the one doing the teaching. You can bet on it. Let's get going then. We have some lessons to go through. Oh, we got a new passenger. Interest. Oh. I didn't really want to go into the sea here, but... Can I go in here? Yep, but well, we can't do anything. <laughs> okay. Hey, sheep. Something is still glittering around here. Uh -huh. Oh! Oops. Let me guess. I'm a bit of a psychic, you know? Your name is Mary? Or Marguerite? It's Missy! Wait, no. Esh! Don't tell me it's- Oh shoot. I'll get it. Someday. <laughs> oh, there's a thing in here. I see, I see. There's a treasure in the window, is what I hear. Okay. We can't get in there yet, because we got to buy that key to get into the building. We got this for double jump. There's a treasure in here. Carrot seed, turnip seed. Okay. We got to be on the lookout. There's a treasure upstairs. Carrot seed, turnip seed. Interesting. Alright. I'm ready. We got a new passenger. Oh, Stella. All this air, all this open space. Yes, I feel I can grow quite nicely here. Look at me, I'm flowering already. But are they an ostrich? Oh, a snake. Ugh. Oh, getting out of this chrysalis, what a feeling. Thank you, Stella. Quest complete, more the merrier. All right, let me get these muscles really quick. And this thing. And our dinner. Two fish, okay. How are you? Eating a meal she likes. You want a hug? You do. Thank you. Okay. Now is not the best time for a hug. How are you though? Has eaten a meal, was recently hugged. Okay. You don't want to talk. Do you want to talk? You do. I've got some fiber I bought. I was going to use it to weave some thread for you later, but if you want, I can give it to you now. Do you want it? Yeah, here it is. Thank you, linen fiber. Oh, Stella, don't you think our boat feels a little sad? Well, it sure could use some greenery. As an added bonus, a small garden could serve us as a nice classroom. I've been thinking about this teaching thing for a while now. It'll be called Caring for Plants, from A to Zalia. 
Hmm, yeah, it doesn't sound- it doesn't ring as good as once I said out loud. I actually liked it. Maybe I need to work on the name some more. Just need some watering. Can this be harvested? No. Need watering. Need some watering. Okay. Alright, what do we got going on? Request. Build a garden. Okay. I do need to build a garden. But I also really need to build a loom. And I need, dang, more quartz. Oh, I can build a garden. Well, heck. Ah, oh, I can't put it there. Alright. Build another guest. Oh, another kitchen. Don't need that. Really want that loom though. Okay. We built the garden. Oh, she's going to see it. Yes, perfect! What a wonderful little garden. You really outdid yourself, Stella. Well then, that makes us just about ready to start on the first lesson. Make sure there are some seeds in these plots. They'll be important. Okay. Turnip. Uh, let's do a turnip. Carrot. And then we'll put our odd seed that we bought there. Water them. For our first lesson, we'll start with something I've been quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules, as you probably noticed already. I've always been a preacher for love towards all living beings. For you see, a garden is a vessel of our love, a mirror we hold to ourselves. This seems truer now than ever. Back on my island, when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers. And as I expected, they grew much more vigorously. Through trial and error, I've managed to write a little song. The plants seem to react particularly well to it. I want to further test that observation with you. Go inside the garden and try playing that piece to your crops. Hold R. Oh god. Oops. Does this end at some point, or does it go on continuously? Oh, it's growing in the background. Okay, I think I'm done. <laughs> Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you entertained them? Isn't that fabulous? As I suspected, emotions in this world manifest themselves much more vividly. Well, I'll make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows? Other passengers might know how to play some music too. They might help if in a good enough mood. Speaking of which, now the commotion of the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. This strange coin has been tickling me ever since I've arrived here. I'm relieved it's not one of those pollen allergies again. Oh, we got an oboe. 
called Oedipal. Oh, okay, we straight up are ready for that to be done. Turn up. Okay. How are we doing? Stella! Mm -hmm. You did good! Now we've got a real boat going. You'll have to take care of these new passengers mm -hmm. now. They'll be the ones testing your patience, not me. But before all that, I have something to ask you. You might have noticed it by now, but sleeping in the guest house is not the ideal scenario for any of us. Mm -hmm. Especially since it's getting crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. You've been terrific up to this point, and it would be terribly rude of me to blame you for mm -hmm. anything. But I think it's time for me to have a space of my own. A nice little house, unpretentious but sophisticated, with a cozy vibe. A space in which I could read and unwind, far from the turmoil of the mm -hmm. deck. Oddly enough, I've seen something with an alpine flair. See, even I can be filled with nostalgia sometimes. Again, I won't be pushy on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build it for me. Gwen's Lodge. Okay. Sprout. Hey, um... Do you want some food? What do you think a snake would like? Want this? Oh, thank you, but I'm not hungry right now. Oh, really? You want a hug? Mm. Oh, you're so sweet. Recently hugged. Are you really not hungry, or you weren't hungry for that? You want fruit? Oh, thank you, but I'm not hungry. Now. Okay, fine. Well, well. All right, let's go see. Is this done? That's what I figured. Um. Yes. What do we need for Gwen's Lodge? Oh, we ha we have it! We can do it! Build it. <laughs> Put it up there. I think I'm gonna rearrange some of this stuff. Okay, escape. Um... I would like to move. I'm gonna put this up for right now and put this also up for right now, but put this right here. Okay, and then do Gwen's Lodge. Right above there. And then move some stuff. Put the field right there. That right there. And put the garden. Ah, oh. Really? I can do that? Oh no, I can swap it. Okay. Uh, put the garden right here then and put that right there okay improve oh we don't know how to improve then okay All right, who's calling me? What's wrong? All right, I guess, oh, no, I guess we're going to bed. Sleep until morning. Just yelling sprout. <laughs> I'm glad that you can just move stuff around easily, you know? Hmm. Actually, I might play again with it a little bit. Hold on. Now that I'm looking at it. Move. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Move this. Oh my god, I keep hitting the wrong thing. There. 
put this there. Um, put this up here. This here, put this. Yeah, what about that? Okay. We'll stick with that for a little bit. Oh, uh, let's wake everyone up. Water the crops. I love it, she says. cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo on Waverly? Mm -hmm. Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. Mm -hmm. I've got that weird feeling. I'm actually rather hungry. Now you can drink some coffee. Mm -hmm. Now this is one damn fine a cup of coffee, blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. I'm fine, thank you. She's good. I want to see your lodge. Oh, it's really cute. Okay, and then uh, let's get up to the garden. Water. We'll pull these carrots. Nope, stop. Plant some carrots and water this. And water there. Nope. Water this. Okay. And then we'll go up to our kitchen. And we'll cook some of the new things that we got. We've got. Cook. Okay. Make some carrots. Alright. What do you got? Stella, I didn't want to disturb you with this, but. For the last several weeks, I've been having strange dreams. We were of a giant snake, and of a menacing reefs, and of rotten fruit. And since joining you and your crew, well, they've been much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea, or maybe the mystical energies of the Everlight. Anyway, I'm now convinced my dreams have been visions. And furthermore, I think they might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. I've been looking at the map in your cabin. My eyes kept being drawn to a specific spot that I marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it wait. How are you? You're hungry and you're having unsettling dreams. Um, do you want a fish? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Stella, don't you remember? I don't eat any animal product. No breast milk or nor ova. Certainly were not meant for our consumption. And the meat? No, no. Sorry, I won't impose my choice on another, but I cannot eat that. Okay. Oh, you found my weak spot sweet spot dear i can't say no to a dessert a delightfully sugary perfection thank you very much you want a hug not right now please okay where's our uncle inside oh oh he's over here I don't have anything to do. I've got the surplus of energy. I need to get my hands busy. Can you do me a solid? You've always been my favorite niece, you know that? I think I need a place to focus that energy. In a sawmill. Yeah. You're just missing some of the key components. Materials. Which I'm sure you can find on nearby islands. I'm counting on you to help me out. I'm sure you don't want your old uncle to sleep on the deck. Right? I mean, that is true. There seems to be quite a few new faces aboard. I like it, don't get me wrong. I just don't want you to forget about your old uncle at all. You know me, I'm Mr. Personality. I could get along with anyone, anywhere, anytime. I just didn't think I'd have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry. I'll be alright. Sorry I even brought it up. I'll just go stand on the edge of the boat and take in the splendor, you know? Hopefully no bugs will fly in my mouth. That's no fun. How are you? He said he's hungry. Uh, you want a fish? Oh, boy, I just love food. Keep him coming. Want a hug? There you go. Don't be sad. Okay. He's doing good. 
All right, let's take a look at the map and see where we want to go next. Although I do think these are ready to be plowed. Okay. Is she about to pass out or something? Why is she waving around like that? Oh, we'll get more coffee. Okay. Uh, no, I wanted to go here and see where we want to go next. Oh, this is where she wants to go. Quartz Dragon. We want quartz. Green Halton Bay. Um, we're here. Let's go get these. Can I know what this is? Look at these crates. I forgot I moved the kitchen up here. Okay, we got grilled veggie. Is that gonna be the same thing if we put turnips in there? You okay? Mm -hmm. I've been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No sorrow, mm -hmm. no hate, no relief, nothing. It didn't really matter to me, but it mattered to you. You spent three days crying in Aunt Petunia's room. I bought you three sisters and gave you the damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mm -hmm. Mum was appalled, but you felt better. I've long wondered why you were so sad. And the best I could come up with is that you were sad in my stead. Mm -hmm. Feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Aww. Are you- wait, you're unhappy now? No. Mm -hmm. I've got some thread here. I was going to use it to weave some fabric for you later, but if you want, I can give it to you, uh, to weave. Do you want the thread? Mm -hmm. Yes, here it is. Linen thread. It's okay. Cool. Um, oh, we're at the crates already. Yes, please. Give me them crates. Oh my god. He's so excited. Any quartz by any chance? I've got a necklace. Copper ore. Okay. Got that. There's crates over here. Crates up there. Um, I don't need limestone though. Crates over here. Let's go here maybe? Okay. Um, and with that being said, oh, was there another crate that I forgot to get? I think so. That's okay. I think we'll water these crops. Let's go check on all our passengers. Mm -hmm. Hugged, eating a meal. Okay. You're good. Doesn't like a tool's banging. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're good. <laughs> and he's good. Alright, so I think with that, we're gonna go ahead and end the episode here. Um, and when we come back, we will continue on uh, to that island and then to the quartz dragon which i'm hoping will give us enough quartz to build the loom uh so guys i want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series if you do want to see more of the spirit fair let's play make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel otherwise i will see you guys next time all right bye, -bye everyone